Hi everyone, welcome to a new vlog. We're in a bit of a rush this morning. We are. Um, I was up late again watching uh, some wrestling last night, but today is the day that we can actually book uh, the first 10 days of our Disney dining. We're so excited. For our uh, Disney moon. It is. You can start booking at 11am and it's 10.56. So um, we quickly jumped to the shower. Sorry, my face is a bit red. Um, but yeah, we've got four minutes. So I'm getting up the spreadsheet. But we've also foolishly got a premiere at the same time. So we're both. I'm gonna handle that on different laptops. <laughs> Helena's loading up the spreadsheet to see which uh, dining options we want to choose, or at least try to choose. Yes. So we'll, we'll keep you posted. We're in. We had a bit of a moment where it wasn't actually showing us the ten days, the first ten days, and that was because we hadn't actually logged in logged to in. our. Uh, we had a little I'll bit of a freak, freak on the out. app, <laughs> okay. but we're in. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye bye. We value your feedback regarding this. Yeah. I got to do the survey. <laughs> Guys, we've had a full on morning. Yay! I'm going to share with you the restaurants that we've managed to get bookings for. Been a little bit stressful at times. <laughs> My card had expired, so I didn't get in till about 10 minutes in. Um, we then couldn't find a Hana. Couldn't find a Hana for ages, but anyway. Then we couldn't find the number to call Hoop de Who. Um, and then we hoop to do. <laughs> I keep going to your own. Um, but then we eventually found the UK number online um, at Walt Disney World. So the number that comes up on the app is the American number and it doesn't work for UK. Yeah. But if you go on Walt Disney World, they have a international UK number you can call. And the woman was so lovely. I think so I got lovely. a little clip of her. And she helped us so much. And we got hoop to do And we also got category one seating. She said we're going to be front and centre. Which means I think we might get picked on. <laughs> she asked... Uh... You'll get picked on because you always get picked on <laughs> and things like that. She asked if uh, we were celebrating anything. So of course I said our honeymoon. Yeah, she was really lovely. Because I thought you could only get category two or three with the dining plan. It takes up two credits but I thought you could only get two or three but she gave us category one which is so so kind and so much fun so we're gonna be front and centre. So for the call uh, all I needed to give was my uh, confirmation number of uh, where we were staying um, and then I had to give my name and then the dates of the uh, first travel and end travel and then address and then a card as well just in case we decided to no show. Um, so yeah, it was, it was easy, it was easy. And then at the end she was like, we look forward to celebrating with you. And, yeah. Oh, she was so lovely. <laughs> I did do a happy dance, didn't I? I, I know, couldn't I was contain, to pay attention. I couldn't contain myself. I was just like, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, another thing that she said is that you can pick your tickets up from the concierge at your hotel seven days before. Um, and if you're doing that, then you can just rock up before the show, like ten minutes before. Um, but if you're going to collect your tickets from the actual venue, then you should be there with enough time to spare, like mm. 30, 30, 45 minutes. And also we need to look at how to get to um, the Fort Wilderness because I think it is quite far. She said the boat takes drops you straight out. Yeah, so. she said the boat is the best option from Magic Kingdom, I think. Mm. Um, so we're going to look into that. But I've wanted to do Hoop to Do for so long. I literally am so excited. Um, but anyway, I'm going to top up my tea and then I'm going to have a chat with you guys about the other restaurants that we have booked. We were only able to book 10 days and our Disney World part of our holiday is 14, well it's 15 days, 14 nights. So um, I haven't been able to book the last few days um, but I will be able to book them tomorrow morning. So I'll also vlog tomorrow morning and then add it onto this vlog. So yeah, we'll share with you what restaurants we've managed to book. We probably won't share the time and date just because a, it could all change, and B, just for privacy, like internet privacy. Um, so yeah, but we'll definitely share with you what ones we've booked, because we're super excited. Would you like some um, biscuits as we chat through? <laughs> some celebrations. Some celebra celebratory biscuits. Yeah. Martin's moaning at me because he's just a floating balloon at the moment. <laughs> you didn't choose mine. <laughs> I didn't it didn't come up with an option, it just said how many guests and I picked two. So I have to add you now. I'm buzz like so, minute. So I'm gonna show you guys just in case you want to know how to book. 
I'm gonna show you on my phone roughly how to do it. So, so you open up the Disney World app here. I like to click on there, show list, and then you can go to dining. And then you can put loads of different filters on. So like the location, the cuisine, the experience. So you go through, choose what dining you would like. So say we wanted to book, say we wanted to book the Rainforest Cafe. You then click on reserve dining. You put in how many people you're making the reservation for. You then pick the date. If you're staying at a Walt Disney World Resort, you can book up to 10 days from six months before your arrival date. So say we wanted to book random day, the 15th of September. Then it says search by time, breakfast, lunch or dinner. Or if you kind of know what time you want, you can click on an exact time. So say we wanted to go at six we'd click on that and then it will come up with what's available pictures as well of um some of the restaurants but it's so exciting still got my ears on because i'm so excited <laughs> <laughs> are you happy with what we've booked i am yeah it's uh you know it's just just Oops. it's it's a weird one it's like the, the excitement but then like just the the fingers, fingers crossing. <laughs> I'm really excited. I mean, you know, you never know, but I'm excited. I must admit, yeah, no, it's, it's really not. made me excited. Um, so yeah, makes just, it feel real. Yes, that's sort of like the fact that we actually have reservations now on our Disney World. Because I always say that, don't I? I'm always like, well, it, just, it doesn't feel like it doesn't feel like we're going yet. But then when you start booking stuff, you're like, and like, then when we get fast passes, I know, yeah. That's next, we've got a plan. Now we kind of have a rough idea where we might be each day. We can plan what fast pass is. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I'll chat through the table service that we have booked. Um, so this isn't in any particular order. So far we've picked these. They might change because we might watch a vlog and they'll be like, oh no, we really want to go there instead. Yeah, we said no, now we've booked them, we're gonna watch video. Yeah, <laughs> but these are the places that initially we were like, we're quite excited for these. So we picked Boma at Animal Kingdom Lodge, which is a bit of a wild card Believe for us Africa. because it's at Animal Kingdom Lodge. It's at one of the hotels, but we thought we wanted to go to Animal Kingdom Lodge anyway because we just wanted to have a look around the have resort. Have a nosy. Yeah. <laughs> and then I've heard really good things about Boma. And then it also is slightly different, like it's um, African. So like the cuisine is quite different from other stuff. Um, and yeah, we're excited, it looks great. So that's on our list, well that's on our booking. Uh, we've also booked in a sci-fi diner. I'm so excited about that. We, we haven't been there since we went in 2016 <laughs> for my birthday. So excited. I love that you just sit in the cars and the, yeah. play the, the little short films. And that's a real throwback for us because that just reminds me of when we went for yeah. your birthday in yeah. 2016. So we were like, we have to try and get that one. And yeah, we got that one, so that's good. Uh, we've also done Be Our Guest Breakfast. Be Our Guest. Be Our Guest. And we've actually done that one before on our 2018 trip with my family. And Feast. we really loved it. Feast à la Gaston. Mm. I still remember it. And we think it's such a good use of a quick service credit because it's not a table service, the breakfast. It's a quick service credit, but you do have to book in advance because they all do go. Um, but I think dinner is two table credits, which is quite a lot. Hmm. So the fact that we're doing Be Our Guest Breakfast with just one quick service credit, I, I think it's a really good... I love going breakfast though because then yeah. you're like, you're in Magic Kingdom. Yeah, you get to go to the park early. <laughs> I think they let you in early. And then um, we can get some good photos as well by the castle and stuff before. And then, yeah, be our guest. We love be our guest. Are we going to sit in the same place? We sat in the grand ballroom well, it, last it depends, time. It depends, really. It depends where it's free. Yeah. I do like the place, what's it called? The West Wing. But it is quite dark. It's dark in there. I like, mm. I like sitting in the main area where you've got the snow. Yeah, the ballroom. Yeah. Wait and see. Uh, what else have we got here? Oh, this oh. is another 
it's not a quick i don't think it's on the dining plan at all it's not. but we had to book it ogre's cantina breakfast <laughs> so one of the days we're going to go to Hollywood Studios early and go to Ogre's Cantina for breakfast. I, I didn't really know about it. And I didn't know you had to book it, um, but obviously it's so popular that it is best. If, yeah, I think you can rock up, but I think it is best to get a reservation. Yeah, well we watched a video and they said that it can be very tricky to get mm -hmm. in yeah. if you haven't booked. So we've got Ogre's Cantina for breakfast. Star Wars. And then probably that morning we'll try and get on the ride, or at least get in the line for like Rise of Resistance or something. I don't know. Yeah, we don't know if Rise of Resistance is going to be on Fast Pass by the time we go. Don't know. Or whether you've still got to go at like really, really early in the early. morning. But we'll do it that day if so. Smuggler's Run's going to be Fast Pass, isn't I it? I think Smuggler's Run is. Yeah. I don't think it is at the moment No, though. but I think it's, it's turning into it, isn't it? Yeah. <sighs> Booking Fast Passes is going to be stressful. <laughs> Uh, we've also booked a few character things and one yeah. of the character ones is Garden Grill at Epcot. We've, yeah. we've, we've wanted to do this for a long time. Well, this is mainly because of Eleanor Dreaming. I always see them go to it in Epcot yeah. with the revolving uh, thing that they sit on and then the characters come round in all of like their gardening gear. Yeah. <laughs> and we thought we'd book quite a few character breakfast because, or character dining because we're not the best at meeting characters, we find it's a really great way to see loads of characters in one go. Mm. Um, so yeah, we're gonna meet Mickey, Minnie, Donald, Pluto, Goofy, probably gonna be Pluto, there. all the classics. Um, so yeah, Garden Grill. Chip and Dale, did you mention them? I mean, oh, it's, Chip and it's, Dale. Called, it's called Chip and Dale's <laughs> Harvest Feast Dinner. Sorry, Chip and Dale. <laughs> so initially, we couldn't get an Ahana restaurant dining at all. No. Like, we were trying every day, all gone. They had a few breakfasts, but we really wanted to go for dinner just because we love the food yeah. for, at dinner. <laughs> um, so we were checking, checking, checking. Eventually, I did get one, not for the date that we initially wanted, but we do have one. Yeah. We're gonna we're gonna try and change it. Is it lunch or is it dinner? It's at, like, four, I think, four yeah. or five. Um, no, it's at five. Right, nice, yeah. So kind of like early dinner mm -hmm. so we do have an ahana reservation if all else fails not for the date we wanted but we can switch stuff around if yeah. needs be but we are going to try again tomorrow for ahana but we also got a california grill <laughs> yeah can't that believe we got a california grill there, isn't it yeah and i think what time do we get it for we got it for five past six and we think the fireworks are at eight so we think we might be able to see the fireworks. And then we believe that it's extra magic hours. Yeah, so we're going to head over after the fireworks mm -hmm. to Magic Kingdom. That's going to be a perfect night. Yeah, that sounds amazing. I mean, the food, what from what I've seen on people's vlogs, looks incredible. Yeah, we really wanted to do California Grill, even though it does take up two of our table dining. I just think it's going to be really special. We wanted to try and throw in ones that we don't necessarily get a chance to get yeah. to. Yeah. And for our honeymoon, we just think yeah. California Grill is going to go be really it. special. <laughs> so California Grill, Anahana, our top ones we yeah. got. Yeah, so we got them. super happy about that. If I missed out any. Uh, just the other character dining, haven't we? Um, oh, have we not done them yet? I we did oh, Bella. we've done Tusker House at Animal Kingdom. Um, we nearly booked Yak and Yeti at Animal Kingdom, the restaurant, but then we thought we're probably going to go to Yak and Yeti Quick Service quite a lot because we absolutely love the honey chicken <laughs> at Yak and Yeti Quick Service. So we thought we should probably try and get a dining reservation for a different, different place. So we went for Tusker House, which is also a character, and we, we're going for lunch, I think. Um, so that's another character. I think all the classics are in their um, safari gear. <laughs> so that's going to be really, really good. And then we've also booked Crystal Palace at Magic Kingdom, which is so high up on my list. Oh, there it and is. And that is all... Look at the picture. Oh. It's Winnie the Pooh and Tigger. All the Winnie the Pooh characters. Um, and that's just going to be so special. Um, <laughs> oh. And we're going for breakfast. Um, we do like a good character breakfast. Yeah. Oh, um, I think we only planned to do two 
originally. Yeah. So and now we're doing I'm all three. I'm for it though. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, I think I don't think we'll do any more, but we've got three <laughs> character dining <laughs> at the moment. Oh, missed this that one. one. Yeah. We've also booked San Angel Inn in the Mexico Pavilion. We have wanted to do this since. 2018 when we saw it before we got on the three caballeros and it's kind of it makes you feel like you're outside yeah um even though it's indoors we said there and then we were like next time it just looked really romantic <laughs> um yeah it just looked really lovely so i think we watched a vlog where tim tracker went and i think they had a good time mm. so we were like and we love mexican food don't we yeah so yeah, we, that was always high on our list that we really wanted to give that one a go. So yeah, that's all our dining reservations so far. I'm booking some more tomorrow, so I will let you know. And then we've got to chat through kind of what quick service is. Obviously that's like, can change on the day, but we definitely want to go to Yak and Yeti quick service. We want to try Blaze Pizza. Mm -hmm. um, and there's loads of other like quick services that we want to give give a go but there are like table service so far also we're not sure if we've told youtube yet i think we've put it on our instagram um but we've booked mickey's not so scary yes so that is gonna be um so yeah really keep, keep those uh, ideas for costumes coming yeah we want something that's fun but also easy to pack and also very lightweight because it might be quite warm yeah um so yeah, we've booked Mickey's Not So Scary and we've also booked Halloween Horror Nights at Universal. Oh. Um, just in case you don't know the details I will of our honeymoon, I will pop the video in the description box. We explain like how long we're going for, what we're doing, because we're at Disney World for two weeks, staying at Coronado Springs, but we are going for three weeks in total and then the first week we are staying in a villa and we're doing like Universal Studios, Volcano Bay, um, we're going to try and do the Kennedy Space Centre and a few other different things so yeah watch that video if you want all the info but yeah we're so excited! I'm so excited! You know what all I want to do today is watch Disney World vlogs. <laughs> That's get, all get, I want to do. Get all your uh, research done. I just want to watch them and like watch all the places that we're going to. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're keeping our fingers very tightly crossed um, that this can all go ahead. Um, but yeah, we are very excited. So we're going to pick this vlog back up again tomorrow morning when we book the rest of our Disney World restaurants. So we'll see you right now. So we're back, it's day two of trying to get all of our restaurant reservations done. It is currently quarter to 11, so we're gonna get the laptop set up. Helena's making some breakfast, and then we're gonna try and jump on and get the last remaining restaurants for our Walt Disney World trip. I've got my tea, and it is 58. 58. And you keep refreshing saying it doesn't work and I'm like, it won't work yet. <laughs> yeah, but how did everyone else get their Ahana yesterday if it doesn't go up a little bit early? <laughs> so we've got Helmer's phone on it, but I've also got the uh, website open. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to try both. Right, we'll catch you after. So slight change of plan. We thought that you'd be able to book the next 10 days. Um, yes. But you can't, you, from now, you can only book one day each day, if that makes sense. Yeah, so it was like, you could book for the entire trip up to 10 days, mm. and now that we've booked for those 10 days, we now have to do it a day at a time. Yeah, so we have to do it for two more mornings, um, but we're not going to vlog them. We'll just tell you what we're going to hopefully get, because we managed to get a Hana this morning. We certainly did. Which is so good, because that was the one which we were struggling with yesterday. We actually managed to get it yesterday, but for a different day. Yeah, for a different day and also for a different time. Yeah. We really want to go in the evening and we've managed to get it pretty much near the fireworks so that'll be good mm -hmm. and then tomorrow we're hoping to book 50s primetime cafe and also skipper's canteen yes and then then we'll be done and there's so many new restaurants there that we've never tried so many mm. so so many but we're so <laughs> happy that we got a hana like that just has made our day um, we've got Ahana and California Grill, which mm. is the main two that we really, really wanted. We need to get on some Lucy Wonder Reed. 
Oh. The exercise. <laughs> well, I do at least, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we're really excited. And then I had started to have a little think about fast passes because that will be the next big thing that we book. When's um, that? That is 60 oh. days before. Ah, oh, that's August then. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Um, so... Yeah, we've got a little while for that one. And then hopefully by then we'll have a bit more idea of what's happening. Mm -hmm. And yeah, fingers crossed. All will be good. But uh, what we're going to do is we're going to keep this vlog going today. Yeah. So we're, uh, we're going to have a uh, we're gonna have a trip to the theatre <laughs> tonight. But obviously not outside. <laughs> we're having an indoor trip to the theatre. Yeah, we managed to score some tickets to the <laughs> National Theatres. One man, two governors. <laughs> yes. And some pretty good seats, I some hear. really good seats, yeah. <laughs> So we'll bring you along for our little <laughs> theatre date night. <laughs> but I hold in my hand... Oh, yeah. ...a certain book. So we're going to have ourselves a phantom fact. So, today's phantom fact is about the, um, the room with no windows and no doors. So it is that the clever Imagineers took great creative pleasure in giving these fiancés names that were full of puns about the unfortunate circumstances surrounding each of their deaths. So this is the uh, the portraits that stretch out. So you've got Barry Claude, chased up a tree by a bear, the bear clawed his way up, Claude never made it down. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Rowan D. Falls was although adept at piloting riverboats, the poor captain met his fate when his rowboat plummeted over a waterfall. you got Ignitus Iggy Knight, Iggy, as he was known, ran the mines, but he was shafted when a stray match from light in his pipe also ignited a stack of dynamite. And then last but not least, Sawyer Bottom. Sawyer ran the mill, but never saw the saw blade coming toward him. He got it in the end. There you go, there's your phantom fact. Look at it. Don't we both look like an advert for hair? Look at it. I think I've turned into Troy. <laughs> you are obsessed with High School Musical. <laughs> I must admit, I have listened to it quite a lot since we watched it. You always cook to it. <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> and we, we were doing uh, one of our workouts to the songs as well. Yeah, they are good workout songs. They are. <laughs> um, but now we are watching The Last Encore. Which I'm super sad about. I We've love loved this show. It. So hopefully it gets renewed for a, another season. Fingers crossed, it's so good. It Especially if you love musical theatre. Yeah. But even musical aside, it's just really lovely to see like where the people are now. Yeah. And how they all come back together. And we've always watched it either while we're eating, like lunch, or like one of the last things we watch yeah. during the day. <laughs> it's really nice. It's a really positive thing to watch as well. It is. So we're going to have to keep watching it. I don't want to do it. No, I don't. So it's been a little while, but I've showered. I haven't put any makeup on because I'm having a chill date night, um, but I've put on some jewelry and I've put on a dress and I'm ready for date night. We're going to a new place called, what was it called? The Creepy... Creepy Hyena. It's called The Creepy Hyena. I haven't heard of it before, but apparently it does the best sausage, mash and beans Ever. Looks like so, your would have made it. What's that? Looks like your parents would have made it. So it looks like your parents would have made it. So it's a very like homely kind of, more of like a pub feel, isn't it? Right. But yeah, it's called the Creepy Hyena. So off we go. Oh, it's lovely. <laughs> the Creepy Hyena. Yeah. It even has glow teenies. Wow. Thank you. They've got a bit of a black currency cordial flavour to them. Oh, do they? Yeah. Oh, interesting. And we mustn't forget these. These are our tickets for the best theatre ever. This theatre. This is also a new theatre. We haven't been before. It's called the Slinker Dog Theatre. Yeah. Um, and we're seeing One Man Two Governors tonight. And we actually got the front row. Eight thirty. It starts. We did. Yeah, I managed to get them. Um. So yeah, starts today. Running time two hours forty, so we better it's be eight quick. Now. I know we better be quick. We're gonna eat this, enjoy our creepy hyena experience. They told me that I don't have to pay. Let's test out the food. <laughs> that was really, really good. The mash in particular. It was, yeah, really, yeah, really, really nice. nice. Um, they did seat us in the kitchen. Yeah. Um, but fine by us. Really, really nice. Yeah, really I nice view. I've just found out who the chef is. Who's the chef? The chef 
is Happy Chappy Phantom. Really? Yeah. You oh, made, you made, he's a chef now. You made the mash and the, yeah, although I'm a bit worried now he's made that. Yeah, oh well, no. We're gonna be okay. <laughs> so I think we still have time for dessert, don't we? Mm. Uh, we just checked Google Maps and Slinky Dog Theatre is literally next door yeah. to um, the creepy hyena, so we don't have far to go. All works out. So yeah, we will probably have dessert and maybe another glotini. <laughs> yeah. But it's 20 past, isn't it? So you better yeah. head over. No, it's only 25 past. So 25 past, right, I've got the tickets. Alright. Um, I think we can take our drinks over, they say. Right, do you mind holding my drinks? Thank I'll you. Drink. Right, so we've just arrived and we're in the stalls. So we're in seat A1 and A2. Right, we better get a move on. But stalls, perfect. Oh, oh wow, it's huge. Oh yeah. Oh wow, it's huge. Time. Nice. Loads of loads oh, of room. Oh, hi. Do you work here? Yes. Can I have your tickets, please? Oh yeah, sure. There you are. Oh bother! It's the wrong night. No, it's. I'm only oh. <laughs> are you a bit cold there? Come on in. Oh, perfect. Thank you. Which way do we go? Oh, just straight ahead. Thank you. Right, need to find row A. That's not this one. Not this one. Oh, row A. That's it. Here we are. Right, go through. Are you, uh, uh, do oh. you want me to sit in first? Yeah, you, you go. Like sitting on the yeah, edge, I like you? sitting. I like having the leg room. You got the loop. Right, excuse me, sorry. There's no one's even somewhere to put your Sorry, oh, is that? Yeah, I booked a, um, this is like a special balcony, this one. Is it? So we get a little table as well. Right. Pop that there. Perfect. Hasn't started yet. Uh, yeah. Oh. No camera. No oh, cameras. I better put you away. We'll have to better you put you away. We'll, we'll update you after the interval. Yeah, I am just going to quickly run to the toilet though before it starts. So, okay. find you in a second. I think it's back out here. Hi, I just ran into the loo. You will remember me. Yes, I can't forget you. Great, great. Okay. Oh, the bar. Lovely. I might run in there and grab some chocolate. It looks very similar to the creepy hyena, actually, that bar. But, oh, perfect. Toilets. Found them. Perfect. There was no queue. Managed to pick up a dairy milk. Very comfy seats, actually. Really, really good leg room as well. Um, but yeah, this is my first time seeing One Man, Two Governors. Um, they might come to a theatre near you guys as well. Um, but I think it's only running until Friday. So that would be Friday the, Friday the 10th of April. Um, and then I think... Jane Eyre is coming to the theatres, um, but yeah, do check that. But I'll put the link in the description box if you would like to um, go and see if One Man Two Governors is playing at a theatre near you. Um, but yeah, looking forward to it. It is currently 28. Hopefully Martin comes back in time. He's just quickly nipped to the toilet. Um, but yeah, it's gonna start. Oh. The lights are gone down. Quick, just... quick, quick, it's just about to start. Oh, sorry, I've just, just about to start. Oh, sorry. <laughs> All right, guys, so I'll put you away and then we'll see you at the interval. <gasps> Exciting. It's a very, very quick interval at the Slinky Dog Theatre. <laughs> I'm exhausted. You've been giggling oh, the whole time. That is so good. It's funny. Oh, it's just my sort of thing. I love, I love like farcical stuff. Yeah, it's really, really good. Oh, it's really good. It's the sort of thing that I'd like, those sorts of things are the things that I'd love to be in. Mm, yeah. <laughs> it's just the energy though, like they must be exhausted. I said yeah. this when we went to see Play That Goes Wrong and um, Peter Pan Goes Wrong yeah. and all the ones like that, which are quite similar in a way. They're really phys um, physical. physical. Yeah, a lot of yeah, like the actors must be exhausted, um, but I'm really enjoying it, oh, it's I really it. funny. There's a really posh guy in it. Oh. <laughs> he's just cracking me up every time he's, he's on. I think he's my favourite. <laughs> and his, his eyebrows are always going. <laughs> but let us know in the comments if you've watched it as well, if it came to a theatre oh. near you. Um, or you might have seen it at the National back yeah. in the day. Yeah, that would be a really good one to go and see. Like yeah, um, but it is really nice. Oh. And uh, we're really enjoying the Slink and Dog Theatre. We are. It's very comfy seats. What should we do now? Would you like another Guatini before Act 2? We've only I got 30 so. seconds. Well, didn't we, um, <laughs> we requested it at half time. Oh yeah, so it should you be just ready. Go, just go and pick it up. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Got to the stools bar. 
And oh, all ready for us are two interval drinks. Right, I think act two is about to start. It is. Oh, oh, yep, yeah, lights have just <laughs> gone out. Oh, I better, get, better make my way back to the seat. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. 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 Oh, is that you? Yeah, I found you. Okay. <laughs> is it just start? Just yeah. starting. Okay. Just, starting. just made it. Great. Right, back to guys. Here we go. That was good, that. Really good. Am I home? Am I home? It's not too far away, the Slinky Dog Theatre. Slinky yeah, it's Dog about, Theatre. I want to say like a two second walk. Am I home? Stars on TripAdvisor, I tell you. Really, really good. Really good night. We really love the play. I mean, their staff. Look, I mean, this guy over here, he, he hasn't moved. You see him? He, ha he hasn't moved. He's been guarding, guarding the stall. But you wouldn't really mess with him, would you? Yeah. Look at him. But I think we're gonna leave this vlog here. Yeah. And yeah. We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye. Bye. Oh, uh, <laughs> I forgot to say, tomorrow is going to be a live stream. Oh, it is, yeah. So it's uh, 6.30. Come and join us. We're thinking we're probably just going to have a bit of a Disney chat. Yeah, we think we're going to do like a, yeah, Disney. Just kind of have a bit of a theme to the live. Yeah. And yeah, just come with all your Disney questions and we'll just have a big old chat about Disney. <laughs> Bye. Bye. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. <laughs> Bye, guys.